Ah, oh, right, just for for not being killed so far, you know. Unemployment's gone down, poverty has gone down. That's great. One of our neighboring countries has uh, had, had a publicly announced case of foot and mouth. Uh oh. Disease in its cattle. Although the chances of the disease being spread to us is very low. You're being lobbied by farmer groups to ban the import of cattle from the can that country as a precaution. There's no... Stat... To st what the hell is that? There's no... Stat... Is the cow... Or scientific basis for a blanket ban of livestock imports from that country. The outbreak is highly contained and poses little real threat risk. This will be in popular move overseas which will be seen as a blatant po protectionism. This would be unfair and unjustified embargo of foreign goods. It's not just worth the risk however, it, it's just not, oh wait, I don't, sorry my mouth's a bit, a bit sore because it's getting a bit dry because I've been talking for so long, I've been, each time I've been doing these videos so far, um, every time I've stopped can't think of what to say properly. All the videos up until now have been a string after the other. I haven't stopped actually doing this. Even though I've been saying uh, goodbye after each video and hello at the start of each video. And I, I think I should stop doing that, whatever. My mouth's just sore is what I'm trying to say. It's just not worth the risk, however slight it may be, of us importing the, this disease to our country. The only way to deal with it is the mass slatter, sl slatter, the mass slatter of cattle, and our agricultural industry would not survive that. This may seem overcautious, but better to be safe than sorry. If the situation was reserved, 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 reversed, they would do the same. That's all. I'm just gonna, just gonna take a drink. Two seconds. Ah, water. Okay, what are we going to do? I feel that either way, this can actually be really bad. I'd rather not hurt foreign... foreign, um... foreign relationships, that's what I'm trying to think. So I'm going to go reject the ban, because I mean if it's highly contained, Yeah, it, the, the farmers aren't going to like that, but we'll, 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 we'll ignore the ban for now. So their party has more members than us, but we're going to get 71% of the vote. Awesome. Detail polls. Capitalists are right at the bottom. And so are middle income. Oh, they've got a good, good amount of money coming in. 621 billion left on the debt. The violent crime is, is still violent. I've got two, two days till retirement. I'm gonna get shot, aren't I? Let's think, is there anything? How about car initiatives? Mortgage, tax relief, this tax. No, tax. This allows people to claim tax relief on the interest payments they have to make when borrowing, they borrow money to buy a house. This helps home buyers to afford their mortgage payments, but can be resented by those who not to by those, but can be resented by those who are not in the position to buy a house. It is a fact, effectively a tax break for home buyers. Hmm. Carbon tax, car tax, flat income tax, enterprise investment scheme. The enterprise investment scheme is a scheme which gives tax breaks to wealthy individuals who invest their money in small startup companies which are based in this country. 
This scheme encourages investment in companies which should eventually grow and stimulate the economy, while at the same time giving a proper tax break to people who invest in them. Obviously, indirectly, the scheme is being subsidized by those without sav saving to invest. Hmm. Growth in the industry is probably good. Plastic bags, unlike paper ones, are not biodegradable, so can last more than more or less forever. Eventually, ending up in huge unsightly landfills sites. Attacks on bags discourages their use and encourages people to reuse stronger, more environmentally friendly alternatives. Capitalists just see this as a as a state meddling. Yeah, and they don't like me at all. Universal grant, law and order. Yeah, that's you know two two uh, thingies away from the from the vote. So is this good? Telecommunicating. Yeah, because that means uh, less environmental damage. It puts up commuter, but really the whole point is they're not going away. They're not. They're staying home. It does drop car usage down and it drops commuter membership. And I don't actually know how important it is to keep the memberships up. Cool. Well, usage. Productivity. Eternal leave unfortunately hurts that. Education. Six. Unemployment goes down. Poverty goes down. The poor like it, the socialists like it. Education goes up. That's good. I imagine the. Uh, let's see how much money we have. We have more, 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 more money. That's good. So I'm about sixty billion ish. Education. Technology, science funding. Ah, it puts up money. Jobs unemployment. Might put that up to how much is that? Six thousand. So put it up six million, I mean. Six billion, I mean. I've just heard that there's been an attack on an oil pipeline in a neighboring country. Oh, not us. Apparently by a rebel faction, and that the oil supplies in our, to our country may be under threat. 
Other nations look like they will be stockpiling oil as a result to insulate themselves against the, effect, the, the effects of repeat attacks. And as a result, the supply of oil has fallen, basically. basically. Ah, oh, my credit rating is triple A. Capitalists like that and the GDP like that. I should have gone up a little bit. Unemployment went down. Poverty went down. Okay, I'm fine with that. 81% of the, the vote. And we've got a 54% surplus. I might, like that's great. State housing. Hmm. Pick up to 30. Again, capitalists just don't like what anything I'm doing. Poverty. The poor like this. Equality. Socialists. Poor earnings goes up. Homelessness goes down. Supply. State houses. Where is actually... Where is... Private houses. Yeah, rent control hurts them. Benefits. I actually think... No, I want... I was going to put out some armed police. Capital per turn is... very free. Okay. What else can I do? Nah, I'm, I'm going to move forward. Because I'm a bit more hesitant now about passing some new things until I get this vote over with. Let's go. Smoked them. Even if they had the, the no votes, the non voters, they would have still been. Yeah? Yeah, they would have still not have had enough. Quick down. So we got. Uh, most of the I actually got quite a good number of the capitalists. I mean the a big most of them just didn't vote. That's kinda funny. The the, the one of the, the people that the, I guess they are the ones that hate me the most, aren't they? International trade's gone down. Foreign relations sucks. Oh, they don't like that I've done the tax shelter. Okay, let's go for it. You have managed not only to win the election, but take a majority of the entire electro elect electro rate. That's now you pronounce it. Isn't it? With you, leaving no doubt that you are the country's legitimate leader. Leader? <laughs> leader. Achievement unlocked. Cool. You have been democratically elected for another term. Somehow you have managed to win over the electorate to your political views. Congratulations. GDP's gone up. Poverty's gone way down. Health's gone up. Education's not yet. Because it takes 16 turns. Right. 
Until recently, this hasn't been an issue. Marriage has been a straightforward issue and a ceremony reserved for heterosexual couples. But increasingly, the more liberal ministers have been carrying out same-sex marriages. Should we ban this as a on a at a <laughs> should we ban this at a constitutional level? Ban it. It is crazy to allow this travesty of a religious ceremony to take place. But standing by and doing nothing, we are silently condemning the practice. The church will be outraged if we do not move to quickly put a stop to this. <laughs> yeah, right. Allow marriages. There is no good reason to ban such marriages. It is no business of the state to interfere in the relationship between loving couples, regardless of their gender. Placing a ban on this kind of relationship, our citizens can form an unforgivable... Placing a ban... Wait, what? Placing a ban on this kind of relationship, Citizens can form is an. Oh, wait. I, I'm, I've totally read that wrong, didn't I? Placing a ban on this kind of relationships, our citizens can form. Oh, wait. On this time of. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm, is an unforgivable intrusion into people's private lives. See, I kind of. I got to the un unforgivable part. And then I kind of. I didn't read the rest. And I thought that was, was going weird. I thought I was reading it, I was, I think I was reading it wrong, but whatever, we're going to allow my religious. Because, you know, screw people for thinking they can tell people what they can and can't do, and who they can and can't love, and who they can and can't marry. Marriage isn't strictly a religious thing. I mean, yeah, if the police doesn't want to marry them, then I'm not going to force them, but they can find a different priest. I do know that's a, a thing, a big... Wait, the, the polls are optimistic. If an election was held tomorrow, we suspect we would get 84% of the vote. Well, that's nice, because we just got a huge number of the vote in the election that happened two seconds ago. So thank you there, game. Okay? And it is a new... a new day. So yeah, I, I I would just say to hell with people trying to stop people from loving who they love. Well, I guess they're not saying you know you can't. Well, some people are saying you can't love or whatever. I, uh, well, whatever. I'm just gonna. That's a huge fan that I could start. Annoys me when people are saying that that there's something wrong with with same-sex marriages and all that. There's nothing wrong with it. If someone loves someone, then they love them, and they should be able to do whatever heterosexual couples can do. Oh, cool. Homelessness is nearly beaten. Okay, I'm gonna stop here. I'm probably gonna have a little look around to see the... the, um, situation that I'm in. Have a little bit more of a plan, but I'm definitely... definitely gonna stop recording for tonight. My throat is really sore. This is... this is fun. I like this game. I just hope all those recordings I have been doing is 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 um is actually recorded. I have some issues with that sometimes. And I haven't checked. And I've done like six videos. But I should have like a hundred gigs on my hard drive right now, so it should be fine. Why, why am I talking to myself when I can just go look? Goodbye. Thank you for watching and listening to some of my rants. And I could go on, but I just end up rambling. <laughs>